And how dangerous are the Blazers now that they have this under their belt? There's a confidence booster like this can go a long way for this team. I mean, you know, they're going to see either San Antonio or Denver, which they'll probably be the favorite against either one of those. And then maybe match up against Houston or Golden State, which could be a great shootout between Dame and Harden or Curry. <sighs> Man, they're very dangerous. I can see them in the conference finals. Before the playoffs, I said, okay, this team's ceiling is the second round. Mm -hmm. But the way they played first round versus OKC, I can see them possibly getting to the conference finals and maybe the finals. Yeah, no, I, yeah, I see conference finals. I don't see finals. Uh, like, as, as exciting as they were last night in this series, but I kind of, I, I, I was one of the people before the playoffs started said, yeah, they're going to beat the Thunder because of all the reasons that we talked about of uh, uh, Portland's kind of advantages in shooting and execution and, and the things that really matter in playoff time. In terms of how far they can go, they really have a favorable edge on the bracket, right? Because if they play the Spurs, they're playing against a team that's much less talented. Right. If they play the Nuggets, they're playing against a team that's much less experienced, right? So they got the right amount of experience, been here before, gone through the trials, but also, hey, we got some horses over here who can play. And I think that that makes some favorites in their next round, like Paul said. And in the conference finals, I know anything can happen, but it's the Golden State Warriors. Well, here, here's the other fly to throw in the ointment of the second round, though. Ennis Kanter went to the podium last night with his arm in mm -hmm. a sling. He said that he separated his shoulder in the first quarter, took a painkiller shot yeah. at halftime so he could play through. And he said, he's like, look, I intend to play through. I'm not missing any games. But he will be limited. They've already taken a hit at that position with yeah. Yeah. Nurkic. So it's just something to watch. And he's been big for them. Clearly, he was really big for them, yes. uh, especially on the offensive glass. How many times were they were coming up with big uh, second-time opportunities because of him? Yeah. But, you know, it, it's tremendous when you Well, Ennis Kanter and the Blazers need to root for the Spurs from here on out, right? Because they need to, <laughs> not, not for who they want to play, and I'm not saying the Spurs would be an easier opponent. I'm saying that they want that series to go seven. Yeah. So... Denver's on the brink of winning that. If San Antonio can at least win game six, that gives them extra days, gives Cantor extra days, and that could affect whether they get to the conference finals. I do got to wrap Separate the Dame shoulder. side of this, though, by showing you what he posted on IG just today. <laughs> it is the unemotional, reserved, calm, detached warrior who wins. Uh. Not the hothead seeking oh, vengeance. No. Not the Come ambitious on. seeker of fortune. He is not. I mean, it's Sun Tzu. He's not talking about I anyone thought, in I particular. I was the <laughs> Oh, did, you, did you guys see the Chris Haynes yes. Yahoo thing? Yes. Where, so the night before Chris Haynes goes to dinner with Damian Lillard, and if you read it, he's talking wild stuff. Before the game even started, he said, he said, he told Russell Westbrook to stop hiding from this. Yes. From this whooping. He yeah. noted he what? noticed he was showing a social media. This is actually at Damien's yeah. house, and he was showing, no. he had a few people over, and Chris says that, that Damien showed on his screen uh, just a social media clip yeah. of basically, you know, Lillard is guarding Westbrook on a majority of possessions, uh -huh. and Westbrook keeps switching off, off Dame of when they come down on the other side. And also he said, <laughs> I'm gonna finish these mother lovers tomorrow. That's what he said at dinner the night before. Oh, so, I'm a finisher. No, I did so not he petty oh, and man. he talks it when he needs to talk <laughs> it. But he's right just there. calm That's on the court. Business. That's right. Quote the great Amina Hussein. Town <laughs> business. <laughs>